Hey, what's up you guys? This is Nick from U-Cars. Uh, this is my 2017 Focus RS. It has the Borla high flow cat downpipe as well as the Borla S type exhaust. I hope you enjoy.
gasket uh, failed on me and it uh, had a major exhaust leak on it. I fixed that with a vibrant uh, exhaust gasket. That's why it's uh, not leaking anymore. Uh, if you want to find, if you want a vibrant exhaust gasket for yours, uh, I'm gonna link it down below. Um, it's also in my other previous video, which will be up here. And uh, yes, this is a Borla high flow catted downpipe with a S type exhaust. So it is a turbo back exhaust system. Uh, the exhaust system. The reason why I went with this exhaust system is because uh, I was concerned about emissions, so I decided to go with the high flow catted downpipe rather than going straight pipe like everyone else is. Uh, I also went with the S type exhaust system because it ha retains a muffler as well as a resonator. Yes, that's right. I have a high flow cat, resonator, and a muffler in this car. And that is why it's really quiet in here. Um, the reason why I decided to go with this whole Borla turbo back exhaust system is because I've had a Borla exhaust system on my ST. It's actually in my channel. It's like an old video, if you can find it. It's on there. Uh, I had a ST at one time, and that's the exhaust system I had. And that was it. Didn't they didn't make a uh, S type system for that car, but they did make a Borla Touring system for that car, which I made it up to another high flow catted downpipe. And ever since then, I just kind of wanted a high flow, uh, just in case you know you go to a state that is really concerned about emissions. But this is the Texas, so. They don't really, they're not necessarily concerned about emissions depending on which county you're in, uh, depending on which city you're in as well. Uh, here in San Antonio, they're not really concerned about it much, but I didn't want that to be a concern in my mind where I had to worry about whether or not I needed to put it in base or, excuse me, I needed to maintain the OEM downpipe. Uh, so I just went with the high flow and uh, yeah, it's worked really well for me. I've had this on the car for 15,000 miles. It, it now has 26,482 miles on the car since the 15,000 mile range when I had when I first installed the high flow cannon downpipe with the help of That's Nobody. It is also on his channel. Uh, link in description as well as in the end. Um, yeah. Living me his dreams when Think of you and me Don't wanna leave The world you see And I will hold you down If love is still alive It's all forgiven To my eyes The tide has turned around Just listen to the sound To I'm gonna close out this video. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, again, that was the Borla High Flow Cata Downpipe with the Borla S Type Exhaust. Part numbers are down below. Um, I hope you like this video. If so, hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.